is up everyone welcome back to another one piece showcasing and it is literally my favorite admiral admiral kizaru he's literally the to, to me he, he's literally like the best admiral for the simple fact is that he's really low-key he's really chill and personally like i feel like he's the strongest admiral and like like out of all of them like hands down for the simple fact is that He's never received any damage. Like, I've never seen a scratch on him. And even during the Marine Corps War, he was just chilling. Except for the fact that he was afraid of Ben Beckman, which are probably, I'm going to assume that he can repel hockey into his bullets. So, there's that. But, um, other than that, you know, like, his, his devil fruit is really remarkable, man. It's, like, there's just, he, it, like, it's defense, it's speed, he can make swords out of it, he can uh, teleport, he can punch you at the speed of light which that that's impact you make explosions i mean there's a whole wide range of um possibilities with his devil fruit which i'd really be very interested to know if uh, uh like what his devil fruit would be if it uh, awakened but other than that um yeah but as i said before you know i will be uh explaining uh how to use each and every character so that if you are having a hard time trying to use this character and you just don't know and you might want to use some certain skill sets traits and help set up your character you're not doing them in the research not helping out i will help explain that um so we're just gonna get straight into the video and i'll explain more Hey guys, hey, uh, really thank you for joining me for another video. Um, as I said up, uh, Admiral Kizaru will be up, and as you can see, he's maxed out, and he's a sky type, so his aerial attacks are going to be your lifesaver. But, let's get to it. All right, now, lucky is he's a speed type, so you have to be really cautious on what you do when you're using Admiral Kizaru. And I'm gonna show you what you need to do. So, well, if you stay in the air, you can definitely dominate enemies. Right here, this attack, wonderful. You gotta stay up in the air to do it. You can spam that move over and over again. And I love this move because, no, you can't. Also, another good move, see this guy's right there. Pick him again. You, you can definitely keep guys away from me doing that. As you can see, I'm getting shot. That does nothing. Keep it going, rock. As I said, dude, he's a. That's a really powerful one. Always, always look at that. So, so literally, the more you're in the air, dude, the entire time, the more damage you do. Remember that. So. Basically, you just want to keep spamming. You can do it too, but... Bro, I'm telling you, just stay in the air. Just stay in the air the entire time using Admiral Kizaru. You cannot go wrong at all. You can never go wrong. Alright. I'm gonna rock these guys right now. Really well. Really good. I'm really. Admiral Kazar is my favorite. I'm really nasty him too. Although, like I said, he takes a. He's not really on the tanking side of. Uh, side of things. So you better be very careful how you use him. And they're all using guns. But, as I said with the. Uh, I uh, uh, Admiral uh, I can't do. All admirals are stupid OP when they're in their low gear form, which I will probably show you right now. And Kizaru is probably the most nastiest. As you can see, nasty. See, I'm too high for them. And you're just, you're just levitating, bro. They can't do nothing. That's literally when I come in with this. 
Spam this, spam it. Spam that too. All the combos are showing you. Look out for it. I'm telling you, man, use these combos, you can never go wrong. Remember, because ours is about. I mean, um. Got a curry, he's about to get robbed. See, as I have not used a single finisher. I haven't used a single finisher, my guys. A single. Oh, oh crap, gotta get out of that. Look at that. Back to Logia. And remember, they won't be able to do end damage either. Unless they have some extreme hockey. They can't. I'm destroying house right now, man. Literally destroying the entire playing field. They can't do nothing because I, I I have I have this whole zone under control. Hold this down too. If you hold this down, you can do multiple of those. So that's actually really good if you're uh, dealing with guys that do long range. Also, definitely look out for the long range. Personally, man, I mean, Kizaru doesn't do as much heavy damage as uh, Ikanu, but I set him up so that he is speed, bro, speed. And everything, man. You gotta use the traits, man. You gotta set your skill sets up. The traits, use your coins. Crocodile's in low gear form, so that's. I'm literally gonna have a problem. As I said, other. So I'm gonna fall back. I don't usually go use my finisher until I'm red zone. But as you can see. Oh crap, he's got me. Damn, bro. This is actually a tough fight. Alright, Buggy's defeated. Crocodile's really annoying. I gotta, I gotta kill Crocodile before he goes into uh, low gift form. No, no, you're not. Go give him time to breathe. Keep him in the air. Oh, he, oh he's done. I'm, gonna, I'm about to go with my little gift for him. It's actually a pretty tough fight. Alright. But it's okay, man. It's okay. Like like I said, dude, your whole... Your whole Thing with uh, Kizaru is staying in the air, man. As you can see, they're not even hitting me in the air. But like I said, I I will always spam this one right here because it's like explosions and it does a really good damage. Look at his defense. Look at Burge's defense. Look at it. Just yep. There you go. Look at Remember, this is playing on the hardest mode. So as you can see, he's a sky type. So the longer you keep someone in the air as a sky type, they can't even breathe. But you're like, you just got, you just got rock, man. Like, there's nothing you can really do. And I'm already, on. dude. It's like hasn't been bad. Literally, like probably about, I don't know, four, four, four minutes, bro. And I'm already, I'm already rock. Oh crap. Oh, good thing I dodged that. So now would be a good time to use my finishers. Also, I have a set skill so that every time my finishers regain, makes me regain health. So I'm about to get health right here. Dagger out. Need to get some more health. Actually, Crocodile is dead. Oh, I just got health right there. Even though I didn't want to. Okay. Now we're about to go here. Go this area right, right really quick. I'm gonna do another finisher. This one I like to use uh, against people that are large, like Kaido, Big Mom, etc. This one, really well, especially if you're going to air.
Crocodile got rocked. See, now I'm gonna use more. Like I said, finishers don't really do much in here. Like, for admirals, I mean, they do something, but not, not the type of damage you really want. I mostly just I mostly just use them for the skill set to actually gain health, and that's what helps me uh, gain uh, what I want. See, look, I even barely did anything damage to a leader, bro. Um, Blow get forms, bro, heavily. He um, when I mean heavily, heavily rely on those heavily. And right there, the guy. I'm, I'm actually doing pretty well. Uh, so we're about to take out Usopp. Never, Usopp's a long range type of person. So what do I want? Let's we'll spam this. And then I'm gonna get close, keep him in the air. I, I won't I won't need to use this to use this plant, so I gotta be careful. Gotta stay in the air. See, see how these plants are moving? Like they're growing. Oh, come on, come on. There we go. <laughs> Alright, there we go. I think, see, see, Usopp's plants grow, bro. No matter where you go, so you gotta be, you gotta be very careful. I, I usually just move, just to move guys back. Now I'm gonna go back to Usopp. Oh, whoa, whoa. He's dead. They're not on the other plants no more. Uh, Kizaru, I like as an admiral because of his abilities. He's really like, uh, keep guys back. See, like, all his attacks are more of, uh, yeah, you gotta stay away from here right now. This sword's pretty good. Uh, the problem is every time he go goes that, uh, he loses, he loses his, um, momentum. So, I, for example, so, like, I'm gonna attack, 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 and then just this. Yeah, when, he, when he's standing still, man, oh, dude, you're, you're so, so at risk. So you gotta be very careful. So this is what I usually do. Um, for example, I'll tack, tack, tack. And when he goes here, I'll just go over here. Tack, tack, tack. And when he goes back, I'll dash. Tack, tack, tack. Like, get, get in that cycle of dashing, man. A lot of people don't really uh, focus too much on their dashing. So as you can see, it's Big Mom. Uh, I'll, show you, I'll show you how to deal with her. I'm just gonna wait until she gets here. Um, uh, I don't know, man. I'm pretty, I'm pretty good at dealing with uh, the Yoko in the hardest mode. We'll kill our soldiers real quick, just so these commanders don't join the fray. Going, there we go. Defense is getting rocked, dude. Dead. Oh, crap, I thought that was her for a second. Search that move over there. Oh my gosh, shit. He's dead. Alright, so. Logia form. Like I said, heavily. Now, Big Mom uses wide range attacks. This is where she's literally gonna screw herself in the end. I'm trying to get that mode. Here we go, here we go, here we go. One, two. Oh, look, 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 watch out, watch out the bar. Watch out the bar. Watch out the bar. Watch health bar, watch your health bar, watch your health bar. Going down slowly, but fast. And I'm running out of time in my Logia form, but I'm gonna show you how effective it can be. I'm about to run out. But as you can see, Can I do it? Can I do it? Then I couldn't finish her completely off of my Lugia form. Oh, look, look at that. Received no damage at all from her. No damage at all, man. That's how you're supposed to do it. That's how you do it, man. I'm telling you, Admiral Kizaru. Very dangerous. 
I love his abilities, man. I love his abilities. Those are so nice. Such a well-rounded character. Uh, I gotta deal with Sabo now. Sabo should be pretty easy. Um, he has also a low gift form, but the difference with Sabo compared to Big Mom is Big Mom does stupid amounts of damage and is very dangerous. So I was gonna run around like crazy. That's okay. I want him to. That's why I like this explosions is that they're they, they're random where they go. You can go in the front, back, and but you keep this motion, bro. Oh man, that's good. Got him stuck in a corner too. Even better. He's so stuck in a corner. Oh crap. He's actually doing pretty good. Oh, he's in low gear form. Go on light mode. My low gear. This is gonna be a very ending. Oh, whoa. I'm doing, I'm doing some good damage with Saba too. But like I said, dude, this move right here, never go wrong, man. You never go wrong with that move. That move is the most nicest move that I think works. Cause, cause you're not only like hitting them, you're like, yeah, you're exploding the guys around him. And the other ones, I mean, yeah, they're kind of cool, but this, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to go for speed, because by the time I go to my next combo, it takes me too long. I already, already rocked him, so... Yeah, man, Admiral Kizaru, guys, so seriously, do not sleep on him. I'm pretty sure I got S, but I'm not too sure because I took a hit with my health bar. Yeah, well, that's all good. It's all good. I'll, I'll take it, but, you know, I was battling the hearts mode, so. Um, yeah, guys, just remember that when you're using uh, Admiral Kizaru, uh, stay in the air. He's a sky type, so that's where he does the most damage. Ground. Only, only stay on the ground unless, like, you need to. Like, unless you absolutely need to. Other than that, remain in the air all the time. And also, use combos, dash, all that stuff. Anyways, guys, um, that's Admiral Kazaru, as I said. And yes, sir. Until next time. Hi, everyone. Thank you for watching another video. Uh, if you haven't done so already, please hit a like, comment, and subscribe down below really helps appreciate build the channel and allows me the motivation to keep uh, delivering more content lets me know that you guys are watching uh it means a lot to me seriously on a very serious note and uh you know that's how you use uh, admiral kizaru very interesting character um he's my favorite uh in terms of his abilities and the way how he's wildly diverse um and uh yeah i think it's time to start shifting my direction of playing other games because as i said um don't want to keep you know adding more videos of the two same games that i'm playing you know it's time to keep it diverse so if you guys are watching please stay tuned for those um remember bully wars up next uh for content so i'm gonna start uh working on some stuff with that um also um I'm probably going to, so as I did with the uh, Fuji tour montages, I'm um, probably going to keep doing those, you know, it's kind of like, it's kind of like, like an anime music video or better known as AMV, but it's, a, it's actually like towards a game type of scenario and I kind of like it, so I'll probably release like a few of those like edited montages for you guys to enjoy. They're not going to be long, probably very quick, 30, 40 seconds long, but hope you guys enjoy and until next time and keep on watching and I hope you all have a wonderful day.